Whiskey Jason here, whiskey from the viewpoint of an American in Germany tasting rare and exotic whiskeys. Today I have something that probably is not that exotic or that rare. The Whistler. Irish whiskey, distiller select, double oaked, small batch, triple distilled, a Bowen Distillery, County Meath, and Ireland. My favorite part is the top here. It says, the full bodied and deep one. Quotation marks, fine Irish whiskey with EY. And then my favorite, favorite part, distilled, matured, and bottled on Irish soil. Irish soil, my boy. Nothing else but the finest Irish soil. Uh, who knows? Who knows? All right, so um, Bowen Distillery, I've actually contacted them, and I've interviewed a few of them, and um, I wanted to buy a cask. I wanted to be one of the founding fathers since they just started distilling a few months ago. Um, I waited, unfortunately, a little bit too long, more than two months, um, because the original 200 and some casks had already been sold. <laughs> sad, sad, sad. We'll see if I can get another cask here that I can actually buy and share with some of my friends over here in Germany as well. So, um, double oaked means two different casks. It was um, originally an ex-bourbon casks and also ex-sherry. Um, to be exact, it says in the bottle here, our distiller selects the finest um, whiskey matured exclusively in bourbon um, barrels before transferring them into our signature Ololoso sherry cask, creating a complex and full-bodied whiskey. Bravo, bravo. Um, 80% grain whiskey, 20% malt whiskey. So, I'm going to compare it to something. This is where I live in Germany, 24 euros and 32 cents at the moment. This is 18 euros and 90 cents at the moment. So, this is Bushmills Black. Black Bush. Rich and smooth. Very good. 40% um, as well. And matured also in sherry casks. So, it says here, um, where does it say that here? So, matured in, to perfection in sherry casks. So, um, very, very similar, even though here we have the Ololoso casks um, named. And I do get the Ololoso. I get a nice um, wa forest um, strawberries, not yet um, matured perfectly. Over here. Mm. <laughs> I don't know, but I really like the bo black bush today. Um, silky. Uh, there's a little bit of a peppermint moment there. It's actually a tiny little bit like fresh mushrooms. Uh, it's very, very nice. And there's a little bit like a champagne, bubbly, um, strawberry champagne in there. N amazingly good for, for the price, I must admit. It's something that I forget. Question of the day. Um, these are 25 euros, so go for $35. Go for 25 pounds. What Irish whiskey can you recommend under the $35, the 25 pound uh, mark? So um, this would be one of my choices over here. And if you can get the Jameson Triple Triple and the one liter bottle that converts into 0 0.7 under 25 euros, at least in my, um, at my nick of the woods over here in Germany. Rare and exotic, maybe not, but I'm the first one to have done a video about this in English, and therefore I can do it. That's my rule. If no one else has done a video, I can do a video about that. So you will not normally not be seeing me do normal um, whiskeys, but they're always going to be a little bit more exclusive, a little bit more exotic, and a little bit more rare. As I love to say, I'm the one who's doing videos about whiskey you may never see. All right. Fruity. Silky. <sighs> nice. A little bit more oak as well here. Cheers. Mmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, nice. Ugly old wood. Fruit. A little bit of alcohol. Ugly old wood again, and it, at the end, there's a little bit of a harmonization of the old ugly wood and a little bit of the fruitiness of the sherry. Oh, wow. That is a roller coaster of, um, of tastes and of experiences, and they're not all good. <laughs> wow. Um, okay, thank you, thank you. My expectations for 25 euros were not high, but they were not 
<laughs> ah, this does not meet my expectations. I'm so sorry. Over here, the black bush. Mm hmm. You, know, you get the grain. Um, it's got a little bit of pepper towards the end, but it's got a fruity, nice, um, silky moment, which is surprisingly, for the price, good. Mmm, that is actually nice. Um, this is like a B. No, B is a little bit too high. This is like a C plus, and a value is a B minus. It's very difficult to get a, um, a great score in the value for money, but this does it. This is an under 20 euro product that just exceeds the expectations. Bam! Um, this, unfortunately, does not um, meet the expectations. I will be doing soon the Bodega Cask. I will be doing the um, I Love You PX, PX, Pedro Jimenez Single Malt. Um, so this was the entry level that they had of the triology. Triology. Nose is nice, actually. Just the palate. Mm-hmm. 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 Uh huh. It does exactly what I said. Nice fruitiness. The old oak comes back in the fruitiness, kicks in a little bit of the alcohol. That old oak comes back in and they just harmonize towards the end, more or less. Um, ooh, what a shame. What a shame. Triple distilled probably means Bushmills. Um, so back then, when Bushmills was sold from Diageo down to Mexico, um, a lot of casks somehow entered the market, um, either right before they sold it or right after they sold it. I'm not sure anymore. Um, and um, the Whistler actually picked them up. Um, they're distilling, which means in about 20, 23, 24, we're going to see the first Whistler products from Bowen um, Distillery themselves that they've actually made. Um, I'm really looking forward to that. They have an awesome, excellent master distiller there who learned his trade over in Scotland. And now he's in Ireland doing his magic. Um, really good th things, I'm going to expect. And they're doing some un unique things, the Whistler. So Bowen Distillery, look, make sure you have them on your radar. Make sure you look out for some of the products they're having, um, putting out on the market at the moment. This particular one, eh, not my cup of tea. Sorry. Whiskey Jason here. Whiskey from the viewpoint of an American. Question of the day was, what 25 euro, 25 pound, or $35 Irish whiskey or less is something you can highly recommend. All the red breasts are gone for that price. Um, thank you very much for watching. Like, subscribe to others, and maybe even share the video if you'd, if you'd be so kind. Thank you. Bye-bye.